Howdy guys. So this morning I got to where I was going and I said, hey Janet and Susan, what's up? And they said, oh my goodness, everything in the Dollar General app is like glitching and saying it's a penny. Um, and I said, oh perfect. I'm right beside a Dollar General. We're still in the parking lot. I'll run and check in store. I wonder if the reason my Dollar General app doesn't work, because it worked fine in this store. When I used to live penny shop before Dollar General stopped me, I used to always go to this store because I get good signal in this store. My app worked fine in this store, but it doesn't at the other Dollar General stores. I wonder if it worked fine in this store because I get better signal here. Anyway, I'm just saying that for you guys in case you have the same problem. But anyway, uh, uh, we always have to say when we do penny shopping videos, don't ask the Dollar General employees for penny items. Um, penny items are a secret. Just go in and look for the items that are a penny. Match up the UPC. You can scan with the Dollar General couponing app. The price at the register is the accurate mm -hmm. price. So if something shows a penny in your app, but at the register it rings up full price, Dollar General says whatever it rings up at the register, that is the accurate price price okay so um things were ringing up a penny um it looked like some tide easter candy toilet paper there was a lot of uh 2018 items in there throws blankets that kind of stuff can y'all give the video a thumbs up for your investigator at 9 a.m anyway uh so i went in store i turned my location on not my bluetooth because i'm an idiot i turned my location on uh and made sure i was at the correct store in the app because it did say a different store i had to change it physically and scanned a bunch of things and they were full price in store on my app um and then at the register so it's it's a glitch something's happening with the dollar general app these items are actually not a penny in store you cannot go to the store and be like it says in the app though it's a penny at my house because you're not going to get it for a penny okay but I've seen a bunch of people in the Facebook group and the Telegram group everywhere saying, like, has anybody went and tried yet? So I was just happened to be sitting outside the Dollar General. I went and tried for you in hopes, in hopes that there would be some pennies. You don't have to waste your gas. Don't waste your time. It's glitching. It, it's not, it, they're not pennies. It's okay. I wish they were pennies. I wish my video was run, but they're not. Okay. I just wanted to make a video too, just so you guys would all see it. I don't, I hate to waste your gas and your time. And so if I can do that for you, I'm happy to do that. If you look stuff, you're very late, Autumn. Where have you been? Um, if you missed it, the app is glitching, the Dollar General app. If you look things up, um, like if you search 0 0.01, a bunch of things are coming up and saying that they're a penny in the app. A lot of them are old items. It's a lot of like Easter candy, Tide, toilet paper, just a bunch of different stuff. Uh, while you're sitting at home is saying it's a penny, but it's not actually a penny when you go in store or you go up to the register. So it's just a glitch in the Dollar General app. It's not actually a penny. Do not waste your time today reading a bunch of posts of people speculating about these items being a penny. They're not a penny in store, okay? Is that clear? I cannot make a four minute video. This is bad. Yeah. Somebody asked me a question or something so we can stall and make a at least a six minute video. Hello, Miss Mini Coupons. You're welcome for checking. They call me the Dollar General Investigator. Uh, I wonder how long this glitch will last and will it affect us. Can you make a 5 off 25 video? 
Yeah, I guess that's what I'm going to do today. How's your house? Um, you know, there's not a lot of contractors in my area, we found out. If there are, they do like commercial, or they're too booked up, or... So we're having a hard time with that, but... Do you know if there's actually a clearance sale on the 28th? Word on the coupon street is that there is. I've heard that from several different managers at the Dollar General. However, we have not seen physical proof from the Dollar General corporate office. The insurance is supposed to come back and pay us. We have paid um, so far like $400, uh, but they're supposed to pay us back. We'll see. How do you check if something is in stock or not at Dollar General? The in stock feature is not 100% accurate. Um, I wouldn't even say that it's probably 60% accurate. And so we've talked about this, especially when we're talking about penny items, because if you read the memo that Dollar General Corporate sends out to managers, it says on the memo, um, these items will automatically be taking, taken out of your inventory. So anyway, um, Janet said walk-in store. I think that is the best way to tell. Those of you who are depending on the Dollar General app to see if something in, is in stock or not, whether you're penny shopping or couponing, you are missing out. Stop that. Stop. Now, maybe if you have like an NCI store 100 miles away and you're thinking about driving to that store, maybe then you could look, but it's still not accurate. You might not go and you might miss hundreds of penny items mm -hmm. or coupon deals. So stop that, at least for now. What about the beauty bag coupon? Um, <clears throat> we just checked, and the Beauty Bag 3 off 15 Axe Dove Tresemme Caress Degree, that coupon is only working on deodorant. So, yeah. Yikes. But that's just another one of those really good um, examples of, you know, things not working like it's supposed to, and then we lose money. Totes? I would love to get some good deals on totes. I need totes. I'm not depending on it. I just don't know how to look them up in the app. Yeah, I mean, you can change the store location. You guys know that. So, what you would want to do is, like, type in whatever you're looking for. Like, degree deodorant. And then it should come up all of the different kinds of degree deodorant. Click on the item, make sure you're at the store that you wanna check, and it says if the item's in stock or not. But again, it's not accurate. That's It's that simple. When will blue and gray dot penny out? Soon, um, but I don't have an exact date for you. I should look what it when it pennied last year. I took a bunch of pictures in the store for you guys. Why aren't the red will red top clear totes marked as seasonal? I don't know, you guys. I don't know everything. Take that up with corporate, not me. I don't control this stuff. I wish I did. I wish I could call Dollar General up and say, hey, I need some totes. Can you please, please mark some down? Thank you very much. The beginning of May last year. I was thinking that it was May too. I thought it was the beginning of May. Just off the top of my head. But I don't know that for sure. I'd have to look. Um, they usually do drag the clothes out for a while. to uh, In an effort to like try to get rid of them before they penny out. Um, so. Okay. I think around March it did. I don't think it was March. I'll look and I'll double check for us. Because we keep record of all of that. Because we have a yearly penny list schedule. 
that I've been saying I'm going to release soon forever, but hopefully I will. What type of totes at Family Dollar? Yeah, if you guys know of any clearance totes, please let me know. I need some totes. What tips do you have for new stores opening? And also, what does it mean when you see the trucks at other stores? Nothing. The Dollar General um, trucks that drive around, they just drop off inventory to different Dollar General stores. It doesn't mean anything other than they got a truck, so they're going to have new merchandise. I don't really have a lot of advice for a new store because you're not going to find likely a lot of penny items at a new store um, because they only have new items usually. Um, sometimes that's not the case. I wouldn't write that off completely. I would still check there for things just because Dollar General makes mistakes all the time. But as far as penny shopping goes, usually you got to wait about 10 months to about a year we found out for new and remodeled stores to get penny items. totes in store so we can go through them. What's a penny today? It, they're not actually a penny. The app is glitching saying these items are a penny when you're at home. But I went in store and checked for you. They're not actually a penny. Don't waste your time and gas. Have I found an Atari or an Infinity Games? No. I haven't really looked though. Do you mostly shop at Dollar General? Yes. Although I regret to say that because I'm not at Dollar General. I've been slacking here recently on knowing that I'm going to move. Like, I can't buy a bunch of stuff, you know? It just is going to be more work for me in the long run. I already have a bunch of stuff. So, um, yeah. All right, give the video a thumbs up. Let me just say this. How do we know when you're live? Subscribe to my YouTube channel and get notifications and sign up on Telegram. Before I go live, I text the people on Telegram and say, live video. So they can be here for the whole live if they want to be. Okay? Did anyone's ad change in the app? I don't know, but I'll check. Um, so listen, in case you missed the beginning part of this video... On, all over social media, there are tons of screenshots of items showing a penny um, at Dollar General today. Tide, toilet paper, Easter candy, all kinds of stuff. A lot of it is even like older blankets and stuff. I went in store to check those items, not only with my little price scanner, but at the register. They are not... A penny at the register or even when you scan in store um, the register overrides the app so um, like this store was telling me that there's these people that keep coming in and trying to buy coffee because when they scan it on their app it says it's a penny but it's full price at the register um, and that the people were mad I guess because they couldn't get the coffee but it says in the Dollar General app that the register price overrides the price at, on the app. So the register's price is the correct price. So if you're scanning something in store and it says a penny, but you get up to the register and it's full price, a lot of you, like somebody called mm -hmm. me yesterday. What do I do? Mm -hmm. I, first of all, if you call me, I'm going to block your ass. Please do not call me. Facebook Messenger, call me. Instagram, call me. Please do not call me. I have a life. Anyway, secondly, the register overrides the app. Period. 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 Okay? Krista posted a link to the beauty bag on her website. Go to my website, thepennylist.com. Scroll all the way down till you see the little black bar there. And then go to Dollar General Dills. It says something about a beauty quiz, but after you take the beauty quiz, you get the beauty bag coupon. Okay? I'll post that link in the description box and the comments of this video after we're no longer live. Diamond electronics are all pennied? No, they're not. Okay. 
I have to drink my monster because y'all are frustrating me today. What if you're doing pay and go? No. We no. People have tested that. No. No. It's a hoax. No. Stay it's not your fault, it's mine, because I just woke up. Okay, I'm sorry, it's my fault. Um, but it's it's not real, you guys. Don't waste your time, gas, and money. Do do something else today. Forget about the pennies today. Okay? Do something else. Go find some totes on clearance and let me know. Okay? If Dollar General employees start talking to you about penny items, is it okay to talk to them? I mean, it depends on what you're going to say to them. I am a firm believer that if I come up to the register with my 200 penny items, they cash me out mm -hmm. and I pay $2 for 200 items. The cashier obviously knows I'm penny shopping. And then the cashier says to me, how'd you know about those penny items? If I say what penny items, they're going to, I'm insulting their intelligence, right? Sorry, somebody was blowing up my phone, so it kicked us off the live, I guess. But mm -hmm. at, so, at some point, mm -hmm. it's Jason. Um, at some point, you're insulting their intelligence, right? But never tell them. If they ask you where you find out about penny items, just say, this is what I always say. Even though they like watch my videos, I'm always just like, my friend told me that these were a good deal and to go look for these. I don't know. So kind of play stupid, but don't insult their intelligence. If you just bought 200 penny items and then you're like, what's a penny item? They're going to be like, bitch, please. You know what I mean? Um, you want to make friends with them, but sometimes I've seen this happen a gazillion times, you guys, a gazillion times. Where the Dollar General employees will tell people stuff that's fake. Like, things are going to penny that are not. Like, a bunch of toys are about to penny. Or even, we got a memo saying that they're going to stop selling, they're going to make us stop selling penny items. Um, they'll tell you stuff like that that's fake, that they know is fake. Just to, like, fuck with you. So, don't take what they say as fact, okay? Um, that's what, or even we don't have penny items in our store. That's the best one. Because so many people believe that. Why would you not continue to tell people that? If people come in the store and they're like, hey, do y'all have any penny items in this store? And you say, you work at Dollar General and you say, no, our store doesn't have penny items. Those people turn around and leave. They don't make a mess of your store. They don't cause you any problems. They turn around and leave. Then the next people that come in and say, you got any penny items at your store? And you say, we don't sell penny items here. And they turn around and leave. Then the next person that comes in and says, do y'all sell penny items here? What are you going to say? You're going to say, we don't sell penny items here, right? So they turn around and leave. And then they'll get that one person who's like, you're full of shit. And they find a bunch of penny items. Okay. All right. Can I hang up now? Because it's too early. When do the cheese balls and big pretzels go to a penny? I said we were hanging up. Um, those surprise penny last year, if I remember correctly. And it was sometime in the spring. I'm pretty sure. Drink your monster. I am. Bye. Uh, we gonna hold on so we can block this person. Who can block them for me? Oh. Gone. Did y'all see that? Did y'all see who I blocked? I'll be saying that shit on my videos. I'm hanging up now.